Hi, welcome to Bedazzle Me. Today I want to show you how I use this splatter paint technique to make these really fun, colorful party earrings. I made a pair in white, navy, and electric blue. I used acrylic paint on the white and navy ones. And for this electric blue, I use color shifting paints. So let's get started. Let me show you what I did. I got the idea after using a silk screen by Ojoy Creations and on my squeegee was all this leftover paint and I didn't want to keep wasting it. So I thought, what are some fun ways that I can use this paint? And I thought, oh, I'll just splatter it on my clay. Now I'm not claiming to have invented splatter paint or discovered it by any means. I'm just saying that's sort of where <laughs> the inspiration for using this technique came from. So I rolled out a piece of white Kato on the thickest setting of my pasta machine. And then I took a hard bristled brush. I find that the hard bristled brushes work much, much better with this splatter paint technique than a soft bristled brush. And then after I splattered all of my paint on the white, I rolled out uh, the electric blue Kato clay in the thickest setting of my pasta machine and I'm using cleaned off my paintbrush of course between each color and I am using color shifting paints to splatter on the blue color and I won't waste your time showing you each and every color so I'll just show you the green and the purple it is kind of fun to watch the splatter go on to the clay. So this is the color shifting green and this is the color shifting purple. I also did color shifting turquoise. So after my white paint had dried, if you start to mess with your sheet before it's dry, you will smear the paint and it will mess up the effect. So make sure it's dry. And I just cut out pieces using cutters that I got off of Amazon and I did these diamond shapes and I actually end up cutting four for the base so that I have put them back to back around an eye pen to make two earrings. And you can see here I'm just putting the eye pen in the middle and sandwiching it with the other piece, smooshing it together and smoothing out those edges. Then I just repeat and do the same thing on the, with the other squares. After I cut out my pieces, I realized there was a lot more orange and I wanted a little more color so I splattered some more pink on there. Then I baked them and after taking them out of the oven, opened up the loop on an ear wire and hooped them on. I repeat the exact same process with the blue using different shape cutters, bake them, loop them on with my ear wire. And this is the final product. I love how the hot pink really pops out of the, on the blue. But my, by far my favorite are these electric blue ones. I just love how the color shifting paint pops off of these. I had so much fun bedazzling with you today. Let me know which of the three, the white, navy, or blue is your favorite. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.